Next exercise is our single arm thrusters. You're going to place the bar right in the corner of the gym because you don't have the landmine position there that I have the pivot arm. So put it in the corner of the gym, use a towel to wrap the end of the barbell so it's not getting dinged up. You're then going to, we're going to start with the right leg, sorry, right arm. If the right arm is up and loaded, the right leg is back. Your left leg is in, is, uh, in front. Again, that position is not so wide with the right leg sticking out. It's right behind in that split squat uh, position or split stance position. Left arm is going to be up here for balance. As you lower it down, this is loaded. So then as you raise, this is coming up and a big pop at the elbow. It's, this movement is driven by the hips. Don't make the shoulders work so hard. Use your lower body to get that spring motion to generate a force or, or momentum up the core. So pop the hip by extending the knee, extending the hip, pushing off the toes, and then pushing through the, el the elbow in a lock position. This exercise is meant for power and speed, so do it fast. And then we're gonna repeat on the left side. Same thing, just switch the feet, have the arm up opposite. It's important that your chin is up and the weight is not getting too much on the outside. So you shouldn't be bringing that weight out here. That's going to put too much stress on the, on the shoulder joint. Bring it down nice and close to the body, just to the front of your shoulder and explode up. <laughs> 